Hey folks, welcome to Build Flight Go. As promised, a follow-up on the dry bot and uh, keeping the engine safe and, and dry while, uh, while it's sitting here in the workshop. Let's take a peek. So again, pardon the mess, right? Like active workshop and uh, there's stuff on the floor. <laughs> and I am wearing my special two airplane pants. Um, I, I put together this little set of sensors. Uh, it's a ESP32 with a Wi-Fi module and uh, four of these temperature and humidity sensors. I just 3D printed, I just designed some cases and 3D printed them and, right, super simple. And you have the dry bot plumbed into this little, um, I believe it's Chinese food container. And there's one of the sensors in there the the tubing goes in it's pointed basically at the sensor it doesn't have to right because this whole area is going to be full of that air and then the exit tube comes up and into the engine there are four sensors there's one inside there's one right here to get a sense of what the temperature and humidity is nearby there's one on the engine vent right here so this is where all of the air or most of the air is coming out because the exhausts are all blocked and the intake is blocked. It's actually dripping a bit of oil because it's probably full of oil in here. And I have one more humidity sensor right there, just sort of near the dry bot to, I, I'm hoping to be able to capture the moment in which it uh, regenerates uh, its desiccant. But we're logging all of this and you can already see, don't know if you can read that, probably not. Uh, the two sensors, one is at the exit and one is in here. They're both under 10%. One's at 6%, the other one is at 10% or 9.9. .9. The 6 is inside, super low moisture, and the 10 is the one that's exiting, which means it's picking up a little bit of moisture in there and just sort of shoving it out <laughs> with the air. And the other two, you can sort of tell how cold and humid it is in my workshop. Um, <laughs> Number three is the one up here. It's 50% humidity, 52% humidity, and uh, 18 Celsius. And down on the ground, it's 16 Celsius and 56-ish uh, percent humidity. But yeah, so we will be logging all of this uh, and graphing, and I will post a link to the charts, and you can see for yourself.